I want to talk about what is going on with the Diddy situation and how does it refer to spirituality. What happens when a soul is absent of divine masculine energy, divine feminine energy, when there's no balance in those relationships, what you will find is what we're seeing with Diddy. Now, we're talking about this situation so much. But if you look over the history of Hollywood, and even back in the colonial days, this particular behavior was going on. If you think about R. Kelly, you think about Woody Allen, you think about Celine Dion and her husband, like we can't forget in this glamorized episode of P. Diddy, he is not the only one. And we keep dancing around the issue of this thing called dysfunction of the spirit. The reason the system is not working is because there is a spiritual deficit that is going on. And what is interesting, I think I said in 2019, the whole reason I started addressing the masculine energy because this is what masculine energy does when it doesn't have balance. So what is interesting about this whole situation is like, yeah, everybody's on the bandwagon. And I'm not, I'm not making wrong or right. I'm not saying, um, uh, you know, I know the alleged. But if we spend time and really think about it, we got Epstein, we got that, that hasn't even been settled. Like, the list for that has not even been shown. Sorry, I have so many people coming into my new apartment. And um, so it's a little interrupting. But I just want to say, we don't even... We, the, the, you know, he's just a symptom of the massive problem. What you're seeing is you're seeing the symptom of the massive problem. But if you historically go way back, this is modern day time still happening. And it's interesting how we are putting so much emphasis on the deed and not understanding the mindset of when a soul is bankrupt, when a soul is desecrating other souls. And so these, this is telling you the temperature of the masculine energy in our society. This is why this subject has been so hard and dear to me because I think as a collective, we all know that it's starting to get really real. The churches will not be scathed. There are still unsolved situationals that have never been solved. 
this Diddy thing is being hyper-visualized, but you have to understand, you have people that are in high places, public officials. You got people that serve our community that lay in plain sight doing these things. Children are not safe. There are allegations about the CPS is involved. And people have been trying to call them out. But they're protected by the people that are here to protect and serve. Because even those people are crooked. And I'm just saying.